This engine is an example of an electromagnetic beam engine. It is typical of engines built between 1831 and 1860, just after Michael Faraday in Great Britain and Joseph Henry in the United States both discovered electricity at roughly the same time. The experimenters of the day tried to use this discovery by copying well-known steam engine design and practice, replacing steam with electromagnets. In this example there are two banks of electromagnets that are energised alternately, which causes the armature plate mounted above them to rock to and fro. This movement is transmitted via connecting rods and a beam to a shaft and to a power takeoff pulley mounted next to the flywheel. Two cams are fitted to the shaft in order to operate the contact timing switches that are mounted in contact housings. The distance between these contact assemblies and the cams can be adjusted for tuning purposes and to achieve minimum mechanical resistance. Further fine adjustment is possible using the timing plate screws. This model has over 150 parts that need to be assembled but as no machining or soldering is necessary, this kit is suitable for model makers of all abilities. Great attention to detail has been taken to ensure that all the parts are made in the style of the period. The brass pillars, finials and terminal connectors, as well as the beam and connecting rods, are typical of the times and the flywheel has been described as a work of art. The model is fitted with a period on off switch that makes demonstrating the engine much easier. This OMC2 beam engine works on 4.5 volts DC. Examples of this model engine are available in kit form from the old model company in England.